Okay guys, welcome back to Squirrel Pursuit Outdoors. Today we're here out in the woods at our house and we're gonna give another shot at making a survival shelter and seeing if we can hopefully sleep in it at night. Uh, if you watched our, our previous survival shelter challenge, it uh, did not go well. And so hopefully this time we'll do it right and we have a good area picked out here. We'll be showing you that around. I just hope you enjoy this video. guys we picked this little spot out here uh, you can see it's pretty flat and we have these two trees that we can get our shelter with and it just it's really nice in here you got all the green ferns and stuff so okay guys we've decided that this tree right here we're gonna tie a string to from there to these two right here uh, it's about I don't know 15 feet so okay guys we're just gonna tie this end to this little maple here. You want this really tight. Okay. So camping 101, 101 is tight strings because if this isn't tight, the whole tarp's gonna sag and you're gonna be covered in the middle of the night. You're not gonna know what's going on. got a very nice string right here and this is really tight it doesn't look like it but it's plenty enough to hold up a tarp and we might even just tie one more on one more string across just for safety safety precautions okay guys we actually have three strings here instead of two uh, so this is really good because it makes it that much more strong like this string this is this is like it's pretty strong and it's things it's twined so it's good that we put three up just to keep it a little bit more secure. So now we have to put the tarp up. This is gonna be fun. So enjoy this little video. Okay guys, so we just, now we just need to put some pegs in these holes. So we'll use like sticks or something to pin it out. We decided that we're gonna use rock instead of wood pegs because it's just gonna hold a lot better. I'm just picking up a lot of rocks right here, trying to get them, you know, a pound or two each, just so, just so uh, they'll hold good. Okay, guys, we have this blue tarp here, just because there's a hole in the back of the of the tent, uh, and we just need to cover it up, just so we don't have two doors, and it'll also keep the heat in. So it's very vital to uh, cover up all the spaces you can. As these tarps are full of little holes that we can put string through to attach them, it's just really good that these tarps have these little holes in them. So I'm just attaching this to the top here, so that'll stay way up there. It's looking really good. That blue tarp back there, that's just so, uh, that's that's where we put the back of the, of the shelter. So uh, it's looking good right now, as you can see. And William, William is going to unravel the flooring here that we're going to use. So as you guys saw, the tent is complete, uh, but one of the things is when you're camping, you also need a fire. So we're gonna go chop up some wood, some kindling and stuff for tonight so we won't get cold. Okay guys, I'm just going to get the four wheeler to stack the wood on.
Okay, guys, now we're gonna load up the bike. Yeah. Okay, here we go. Yep. Let's do this, bud. a good spot under here though. Yeah, okay guys, we're gonna stack the wood right here. We stack it all under this tree so no rain can get on it. Okay guys, so we got our pile of wood. We still have to get some more, so. One more load. Yep, one more load. <sighs> Out of the truck, out of the truck. That's our complete wood pile that we're gonna have for tonight. Yeah, I mean, they're all, some of them are, might be a little bit too long for the area that we have here for the fire, but I don't think they're, I think it will be good, so. Uh, yeah. Okay guys, we are gonna get some of this tinder here. This is birch bark, and it's a lot of it, so. This stuff, Makes your fire go crazy. There we go. Okay, guys. We are ready. Okay, guys. It is uh, about quarter after 11. And we're going to head out to the shelter. And uh, we're going to get this stuff going. Uh, it's time to face up to our... Uh, Face up to uh, challenge. the challenge, yeah. So uh, hopefully this, this night goes well. Not a whole lot planned. Just start a fire, get it going. Maybe cook a marshmallow or two and then just hit the sack, you know. Uh, so this should be fun. Hey, guys, we got our first load of stuff here at the camp. Now we're going to go get our second load. Hey, okay, guys, we're just going to start building our fire. So we're going to get our bricks right here. We're going to watch out. Uh, we can't start a fire with this. I don't know what's wrong. One of the main things that we do when, when we do fires is you take a cotton ball and put it in Vaseline. And we're going to put this down here. We're going to put it right underneath the whole fire. And it's just going to get started when we light it. Just so you guys don't know, so what we did is we have birch bark on the bottom and then we took a bunch of sticks and did them like in a Jenga style, like a cross. So, uh, and the cotton balls under there too, so uh, when we light this, it's all going to go up in flames. It's supposed to, so. Okay guys, the fire's going good right now. We're just starting to catch all the sticks. I can't tell you guys how satisfying it is to watch your your fire that you're trying to make actually catch up and light up in flames. Let's see what we got in here. We got some marshmallows. Okay. That's what we want right now. Nothing better than what are these called? Jeff Jetto. Something like that. William's gonna get hacked into that bag. Good? Yep. Okay. Right. Yep. Oh, yeah. Is that good? Oh, yeah. You've been having a fun night out here by the fire, just sitting and watching it and eating marshmallows. But it's late and we're tired, so we'll see you in the morning. Well guys, we survived the night and we actually did this time. Yeah. Uh, it was it was a little bit chilly. Coyotes were howling. 
yeah, he heard a couple of things walking by the tent, but that was that was more so just and nothing was harmful. It came by the tent. It was it was fun. I tell you, I'd like to do it again. Not tonight though. I'd like a good rest in my own bed tonight. But uh, it was good. Yeah. We got the fire started here, and then once we get a good bed of coals, we're gonna cook some stuff up. Okay, guys. So we have a cast iron pan here. Are we going to put on the fire? We're going to cook pancakes this morning. So I'm just going to make them up. We don't have chocolate chips, so we'll either just eat them plain or put marshmallows in them. Yeah. Hey guys, we're going to put a butter in the pan. Oh. There you go, Wayne. Thanks. For watching this video i hope you enjoyed it this was probably my favorite video um out of all of them it was really fun to camp overnight and cook our own food um so just thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe